Hello, welcome back to Chemba's Entertainment. So we've all just watched Love Island's latest episode where we've actually gotten to see what Rachel's like. First impressions is she's actually a really nice, uh, friendly girl. She's very chatty. I mean, when she was talking with Chogs, he barely got a word in because <laughs> he's super chatty, but she seems like a really nice girl. My thoughts with this love triangle is I'm still not sure if any of them are genuine. I genuinely believe that Brad is attracted to her. But I'm not sure if if someone more his type comes in, he'll just jump straight away. Right now, they both need to stay in and they want to stay in. So they're basically both using her at the moment. Only time will tell how genuine either of them are. I think it was annoying for Love Island to leave us on a on a cliffhanger because there's literally no point. It's so early in the season. You're making us wait just for her to say. Either way, I think she would choose Brad. Um, only because I feel she had more chemistry with Brad, but she definitely doesn't trust him. I feel like she thinks he's like a heartbreaker. So she chooses him, she will be the one to get fucked over. Which is why she might, if she chooses Chugs, I feel like that will be the reason. Because she don't want to get violated or embarrassed. So, well, we'll find out tomorrow. However, there was something Chugs said about her which I didn't like. And I don't know if anyone else spotted it. And I'm sure it was him. My mistake. Let me know if the comments if I got the wrong person. But... Someone asked him what's his thoughts on her and then he said, yeah, I really like her, she's feisty. And that really bothered me because she ain't, why, why is he calling her feisty? She ain't done nothing yet. She's come in, nice girl, confident. I'm thinking, so why, why is he calling, why is that his first adjective to describe her, feisty? Mm, that's why I'm not sure with that one because... When it's a, you know, white girl who's confident, she's she's sassy and she's, you know. But when it's a black girl, they're calling her feisty when she's absolutely been sweet so far. So I really feel like, you know, it's a little bit of a red flag in terms of being with a guy who already sees black girls like that. I don't know if I'm overthinking it, but that alone should have, you know, cancelled him out of the running. Let me know in the comments if you think I'm overthinking it or if you if you heard it and you agree that it's, it's a bit dodgy. I know I've mentioned it before, but Kaz and Toby's situation is getting more embarrassing every day. It's the fact that he only wants to kiss her or he only kisses her when he has doing challenges. They've been together for a week now. She, he don't cuddle her, he don't kiss her, she obviously wants it, the fact that she even asks for it, she's there trying to make herself pretty for this guy who doesn't even want to kiss and hug her, and I think it's a bit sad, like, because she's, he's not even on her level anyways, but I still feel like he's waiting for better and then he's going to ditch her. Um, which is why he's trying not to lead her on with hugs and kisses, but she's not getting a hint and she's still falling for him. So the fact she noticed herself today that he won't kiss outside of challenges is a red flag that he's really not that into you. And I really want her to move on from him. I just think he's staying with her just to be safe, just to have someone there, but it's definitely not any real feelings and it's definitely not genuine. Um definitely a red, a red flag with him i don't think their relationship's gonna go anywhere but yeah anyways let me know your thoughts so we can discuss it in the comments thanks for watching as always like comment subscribe 